In the late 22nd century, humanity is beginning to colonize space. Before colony ships arrive, habitation vessels are appointed terraforming missions. The Aurora was one such vessel. During its descent, the Aurora was struck by a mysterious energy pulse, resulting in catastrophic hull failure. A single life pod jettisoned prior to impact. You were in that life pod. Hey guys, welcome to Subnautica with me, John Soros. Um, I have not played this game before. This is the early development build. Um, this game is kind of like a uh, you're on another planet. It's all about being in the deep ocean. Um, I've got a, uh, a really big phobia of uh, not necessarily like the sea, but but just being uh, you know out in the open of the sea, not having anything around you. Uh, depth kind of freaks me out. Um, I played uh, the Drowning Simulator uh, quite recently and didn't go well. Um, so we'll see how this goes, but uh, this game's got a really cool feel about it. Um, I, I think it's probably going to suck for this first playthrough, but um, yeah, let's have a look. So essentially we've just crash landed. Uh, we're in this uh, pod. Um, it's a little bit, a little bit jerky. Um, okay, so this is the fabricator. Um, cool. Um, sorry, I've not seen this. So I'm, I'm uh, sort of commentating as I go. Attention, detecting increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent with ongoing degradation of the Aurora's dark matter drive core due to damage sustained during collision. Continuing to monitor. Right. So I don't know if there's some kind of time limit on this uh, in terms of stuff we, we have to do within a certain time period um, in terms of uh, escaping or whatever so this is like where I can construct stuff but basically this game you can build anything you can you can build bases you can build uh, sh like submarines and stuff um, I, I, I'm on survival mode so you can see in the in, in the bottom uh, left hand corner there's uh, oxygen health uh, sustenance, food, uh, and water. Um, so that kind of stuff we have to handle, look after. So time is such a good essence. Whoa. Okay, this is really cool. Uh, but again, yeah, as I said about being being sort of freaked out by the deep ocean, yeah, this uh, certainly qualifies as that. Nice. Automated short range stress signal failed. Life pod secondary systems are offline. Let's go to the top. Whoa. See, it's not Earth. It's, um. Ah, uh, okay, so here's the. Here's the ship. Uh, we escape podded from. I think it's actually pretty far away. It's huge. <laughs> Uh, right, let's look some. Let's look some. Okay, okay, this is my, this is my base. Let's look for some food. Um, what's this? Ah, uh, cool. So, yeah, this kind of stuff we have to. Um, we're just gonna have to collect in order to build things like the tools, like the, like the submarine and things like that. Ah, oh, cool. This is so awesome. Nice. Whoa, what the fuck is that? Some crazy swordfish. I don't know if these things can kill me. Uh, is it bleeding? Shit. Uh, break the limestone. Break oh, fuck, I can't go near it. This is crazy. Too scared of this thing. I don't think it can hurt me. Um, I don't, I don't think that's the hostile one. <laughs> totally gonna be wrong as well. Fucking kill me straight away. Die within 10 seconds. Ah, oh, nice. Titanium. Titanium discovered is low density. Fuck is that thing? Uh, titanium is low density, high strength material that does not rust. Concentrations about the Continued degradation of the Aurora's drive core. Tons may tons of these cause things. a quantum detonation. Calculating risk Ooh. assessment. Death by malnourishment. 7%. <laughs> by physical injury. I think it's more than that. By exposure to radioactive crash site materials. Oh wow! Oh shit! Oh my god! The probability I'm, I'm... of death increases oh. to sixty-five. Come on. Emergency. Ten seconds <laughs> of oxygen okay. remaining. Ten seconds. Okay. 
So I ran out of oxygen there, um, kind of blacked out, went to the surface. I don't know if one of those little swordfish things attacked me as well. Big swordfish things, even. Because um, I've lost some health. Okay, that sucks. I've got really little oxygen. Just to keep going up to the surface. Arr, come here, you bastard. Come here, you fucking fish cunt. Come here. Can I eat it? Um, come here. Whoa, acid mushroom. Can I eat that? Oh my god. Okay, I can't pick him up for some reason unless I'm using the wrong control. Let's just pick this up. Ten seconds Jeez, I'm running out of oxygen remaining. again. I'm forgetting about that. Come on! You bastard. Go, 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 go! I don't know if you died with the PDA attack. Ah, oh, nice, is he? Okay. Blueprints. Yeah, I see. So this is what I was talking about in terms of, um, you know, building your base and that kind of stuff. So you, you can, I think you can actually build, like, really big structures. Um, actual, like, huge bases, so, like corridors, um, foundation. It's really in-depth. And, uh, you know, you can get weapon systems and things like that. Mobile vehicle bay. Yeah, so that's for things like the submarines and I guess the boats and, and things like that, that that will come later. Uh, what's this? A little photo album. Uh, let's have a look down here. The scenery is really, really good. I've only got the graphics on um, recommended, but they're still pretty, pretty good. Um, it's on my Mac right now, so it, it's not playing it too well. Um, and I'm also not using a gamepad because it's not functioning. But it's, I mean, it's jerky. And as soon as I said that, it's gone really jerky. You bastard, you predicted it. Fucking bastard. Back up and back down. Oh, nice. Oh, fuck, there's that thing again. You bugger off, don't come near me. Warning, local radiation readings exhibit characteristics consistent with total degradation of the Aurora's dark matter drive core. A quantum detonation will occur with a probability of 85.5%. Is that the Aurora? Advise observing a one kilometer safety range. So that thing's going to explode. Okay, let's pick up a few bits of... Let's try and find some food now. I guess I can't eat those fish. Um, I can eat anything else. I mean, I must be able to get something. Creep that. Okay, let's get this. Well, the noises as well. You know, the, the sound effects. Really creepy. Um, you know, going through that kelp forest, you can hear absolutely everything. Also, sort of crushing down on everything. Uh, this shelter. Emergency. Ten seconds yeah, yeah, of oxygen yeah, yeah. remaining. It's gonna get annoying. Emergency. Ten seconds. Oh, eat something. Okay. Okay. Where's the arrow? This stuff? Can I... Can I eat this? I guess so. Come here. I can. I can get this. I saw... I saw an arrow pop up. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! Local life forms may be suitable for consumption or for other applications. <laughs> spectroscopic and lancet. <laughs> Fuck God. I did so well with the spectroscopic, but not so well with uh, analysis. Um, yeah. Dyslexia powers. Dyslexia superpowers coming into play. Right, can I hate this guy? No! Oh shit, I'll let it go. You sneaky, lucky bastard. I can eat your mate over here. Emergency. Seismic readings suggest oh. a quantum detonation has occurred in the Aurora's drive core. The central dark matter reactor will reach a supercritical state. It minus. I hate it. Ten, I want to watch this. Nine, eight, seven, Is this kill me? Six, five, I think I'm going to kill me? Three. Is that radiation? I think that's radiation. Wow. Okay, so that's fucked. Uh, 
I don't know if we can go over there, but at least we uh, at least we didn't die. Oh my god, it's night time. Okay, so this this is the worst. Being in the ocean at night time. Is there anything worse? I don't want to look down. What is it like? Oh, oh wow, that's actually pretty cool. Oh my god, can you imagine? Can you imagine? Just being in the middle of nowhere. At least I could see the uh, the bottom of the sea. If I couldn't, and it was just you know nothingness, just a void, that would be that would be pretty bad. Right, let's go back up. I apologise for the jerkiness. I think I might have set the graphics uh, just a little bit too high for uh, my computer. Okay, so we've got titanium. Oh wow. Do you like? Oh, okay, so this is me uh, turning the metal salvage I found into the titanium, which I guess can then be used into to make other items. Uh, but that's the really cool thing about this game, is I think this this little fabricator menu. Yeah, I need to eat. I need to get water. That's what I'm sucking at right now. Okay, sustenance. Water. What do you need? Filter water. Air sack. Those are those fish. Yeah, okay. Uh, I thought I had one of those, but maybe not. Pipe. Get air from the surface. O2 tank, titanium and glass. Need some glass. Is that health stuff? Can I go? Storage? Oh, cool. Gold. Wiring kit. Shit silver wire. Alloys, what's that? Lithium, cool. Survival knife, yes. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, move this all over. Yeah. Cool, okay. Nice, we got a knife. We're getting there, guys, we're getting there. Not quite completely sucking anymore. Right. So I can't eat these ones, I could eat the other. Kind of fish. I don't know what this does. Soon. What can I do? Nah. Can we get in the other? Okay, let's go for a little wonder. Let's go there. Oh, it's night time. Oh, can we like sleep and wait until day? I really don't want to go out like this. Oh, fuck it. Boy, gotta eat. Gotta eat. Oh my god, fuck! Ah! You shitter! What? No! No, I don't like it, it's dark, I really don't like it. Oh shit! Ah, he's over there. Can I attack him? Let's attack, let's attack. Oh shit, man. That's terrifying. That's fucking terrifying. And that was just that fucking swordfish. It's not a swordfish, it's not a crocodile. <laughs> Weird shark crocodile. You know, the resources are actually quite. Unless I'm being completely blind. Quartz. Oh, what? Emergency. 10 seconds so, of oxygen I'm remaining. Really sure I'm going to die, but I don't know. I think, I think you can dig. Oh, fuck off. No, 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 no. Oh, get home, get home, get home. Oh, this is crazy, they're right next to my base. I'm nearly dead, I've got 10%. That's creepy, man. <laughs> That's really creepy. Those things. Oh, I need, I need help. I need help. Titanium anger. Try. Sorry, I've got a cold at the moment. Um, I think I'm getting pretty, pretty ill. Um, waterproof locker. So this is really cool stuff. Um, my worry is now that I have no health. I think nighttime there's more of these 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 enemies about these these sharks and things like that. Um, so it's I don't know, is it daytime yet? Okay, yeah. It's kind of dawn. 
go out. Can I, I, I can eat this guy, I think. It's like fast one. Alright, come here. Does eating restore um, health as well? Or am I just living like this? I did choose the survival mode, so. I'm never gonna be able to catch this guy with a goddamn mouse. I think next um next episode I'll um get my game pad to work on this pad rather than stuff like Magic Mouse. Emergency. Ten yeah, seconds yeah. of oxygen remaining. <laughs> I'm going to the Kelp Forest. There should be some pretty good stuff down there. Quartz. Cut creep vine with knife. Okay, okay, how do I do that? What is... Ah, here we go. Right click. Get the creep vines up. Okay, cool. Can I... I can eat that. Food plus H2O. Oh, yes! What I need now is something to up uh, my health. Yes. Yes! Come on. Okay, it's alright. So now... Does it do anything bad? Can I raw food? Oh, I'm dropping it. Oh, I'm dropping it. Oh, that's cool. I mean, not the most realistic thing, a little, little leaf box dropping out, but... Old creep line sample, it got old because I dropped it. <laughs> What's this one over here? The yellow stuff. Creep line sample, the same. Seed clusters. Okay, so I guess I, I guess we can like plant things and things like that inside. That'd be really cool. That'd be really exciting. I don't know quite what the uh, metal salvage and titanium uh, is, is going to build up, sort of first thing, but uh, yeah, it's one of those things that we've been lying around. Ten seconds of oxygen yeah. remaining. Jesus. Can we switch that off? Actually, to be fair, if we switch it off, I'll probably just forget about it and go down really deep and die. Oh, this is cool. It's seriously deep. See, this is where, you know, you start to realize, okay, I, I need, like, submarine. Something like that, because... I best. Um, it's just a bit too deep to swim down. Especially with the amount of oxygen I have. I think you can increase it. You can get another air tank and some, some and spare oxygen and things like that. So it'd be cool when we get that. Emergency. Just Ten water submarine. Of I'm kind of wishing I did the creative mode because I think without one you can build that. You know, you can straight away build a huge base. I might do that just for a play around in the later episode. Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa! An underwater volcano. Jesus. Okay, I'm not going to have to go down there. Oh, that's creepy. Oh, no! Okay, it's still going. <laughs> that's definitely going to kill me if I go down there. This is spraying out stuff. Is there stuff I can pick up? This is stupid. This is so stupid. With such low health. No, no, okay. Yeah, there's fire down there. That's just stupid. Come on, John C. Come on. Oh, that looks so cool. Just massive red moon. What does it say on my knife? <laughs> Altera arms. Nice. Hopefully we can learn more about the backstory and things like that, about where we actually come from. Um, so you can see we are human. You can see the body. Um, it's not, I'm not alien or anything like that, but I don't know if we came from... What the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? Please tell me you heard that. It's like a big whale. That was creepy. Oh, this game is just stunning. This game is so. Oh, shit. This game is so stunning. Emergency. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. I'm really getting sick of that now. Can kick it, you make it, you Right. Eat. Eat. Caution. Dehydration warning. Oh! Last detected. What? Red knots detected. Emergency. Subviation dehydration. Detected. Immediately. What happened? 
Did I eat too many? Did I get poisoned or something? Oh, I knew it was too good to be true. Oh, I'm pretty screwed right now, I think. This is one of these games where, you know, it's probably actually not that good for, uh, for a kind of let's play and things like that because it, I think, takes a long time to, um, to get to know how to play it and, you know, actually, actually really come, Jesus, really come good at it. Quartz! <laughs> Alright. Emergency. Ten seconds of oxygen I know I keep remaining. saying it, but... This game is just so, so beautiful. The sound of that volcano, the sound of the whale I heard earlier, like, look at that. And we can go down there. So much opportunity. So good for a, for a game, you know, it's in, in, in early development. Really, really good. Okay, guys, well, look, um, I'm going to leave it there. Um, I'm going to have a, uh, a bit of a playthrough. Um, just you know, uh, before episode two, and rediscover a bit more about it, so it's a bit less boring for you guys. Um, hopefully, figure out how to how to eat, how the food system works. Um, start to figure out how it works in terms of base building and, and all that kind of stuff. And then I'll come back in episode two, having played a little bit more. I'm not going to jump too far ahead. Um, but yeah, I, I've really enjoyed playing this. If you guys like it, please, please do leave a like, please comment or message me with, with what you think about it. If there's anything I'm really missing, which I'm sure there's loads of stuff, just let me know, please do. Uh, and last of all, please, please subscribe. I'd really like to, to build something here where, you know, we can just have people talking about these games and uh, especially these kinds of things in development mode and things like that. I think it really helps to, to talk about it and, uh, you know, give your ideas on it, what I should do next with it. That'd be really great. But uh, yeah, thank you. Thank you all so much for watching.